packed with beautiful landmarks, world-class attractions, and unforgettable experiences, London sets itself apart from other cities of the world. However, the various available activities can make it hard to choose the best one. So in this video, we'll be showing you the best 10 things to do in London this summer. We start off with a visit to Buckingham Palace. Buckingham Palace is the official London residence and headquarters of the King of the United Kingdom. Located in Westminster, this majestic palace boasts 775 staterooms, including 19 grand staterooms for events, 52 royal and guest bedrooms, 78 bathrooms, 188 staff bedrooms, and 92 offices. The palace is protected by the esteemed Household Regiment, whose ceremonial duties include the famous changing of the guard. Discover the grand staircase, throne room, and exquisite artwork on display. Combine your visit with a tour of the palace garden, a stunning 39-acre space with over 350 different types of wildflowers, a 3-acre lake, and 200 trees. Whether you're a royal fan or a history enthusiast, Buckingham Palace offers a glimpse into the grandeur of the British monarchy. After visiting the palace, then you can enjoy a classic tea in one of the oldest shops in London. Twining's Tea Shop Twining's Tea Shop, located in the heart of London at 216 Strand, has been an iconic destination for tea lovers since 1706. This narrow shop, lined with wooden display shelves, offers an extensive selection of over 100 teas worldwide, including exclusive blends and classics like English Breakfast and Earl Grey. Stepping inside, you'll be surrounded by the rich aroma of tea and the warm, inviting atmosphere of a traditional British tea shop. You can also take a moment to check out the Twinings Museum, dedicated to the brand's 300-year history and admire the original royal warrant granted by Queen Victoria in 1837. As a tea shop that serves the royal family, the current royal warrant, the coat of arms of Queen Elizabeth II, can be seen from just above the entrance. From tea tastings to master classes, Twinings offers guests a stunning experience they won't forget so soon. Next, experience the magic at the Leadenhall Market. Leaden Hall Market, sitting majestically in the heart of London's financial district, is a stunning and historic destination that offers a beautiful shopping and dining experience. This beautiful market, with its ornate 19th century painted roof and cobbled floors, has been in operation since the 14th century and boasts a rich heritage. Once a popular spot for buying meat and fish, Leaden Hall Market now features a range of boutiques shops, restaurants, and bars. If you're a fan of Harry Potter, you'll recognize the market as the filming location for Diagon Alley and the Leaky Cauldron. Today, visitors can enjoy various activities, including shopping for jewelry, watches, and books, indulging in delicious food and drink at upmarket eateries and wine bars, and taking in the magnificent architecture of the Victorian covered market. On number 7, we'll recommend visiting the God's Own Junkyard. God's Own Junkyard is a kaleidoscopic wonderland of handmade neon signs in Walthamstow, displaying vintage signs, props, and figures created by Marcus Bracey. This psychedelic paradise is home to retro diner emblems, lurid Soho-inspired displays, and film props from Captain America and Eyes Wide Shut. The collection is a visual feast, with neon lights dazzling the eyes from every corner. If you're looking to light up your home, you'll find unique inspiration here. With a cafe on site and nearby bars and restaurants, make a day of it. Chris Bracey's personal neon art collection shines bright in this London destination, waiting to mesmerize you. After this, don't forget to see London from the London Eye. The London Eye is a ferris wheel on the south bank of the River Thames, offering a panoramic 360-degree view of some of London's greatest landmarks like Big Ben and the Shard. Designed by Julia Barfield and David Marks, it stands 443 feet tall 
making it the world's tallest Ferris wheel until 2006. The London Eye has 32 capsules, each representing London's 32 boroughs, alongside a capacity for 25 people. The capsules rotate at a leisurely pace, taking 30 minutes to complete a rotation. Over 4 million people visit the London Eye annually, making it one of the capital's most popular paid attractions. You don't want to miss out on this, do you? Open daily from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m., step into a capsule and enjoy stunning views, interactive guides, and the London Eye 4D experience. This beloved attraction offers a unique perspective on the city, making it a must-see for anyone looking to experience London's beauty and charm. Now we're down to the best five. And on number five, we have the visit to the London Zoo. Located in Regent's Park, London Zoo is home to over 650 species of animals, making it one of the largest and most comprehensive collections in the world. As the world's oldest scientific zoo, it has a rich history of innovation and conservation. From the majestic Asiatic lions to the playful ring-tailed lemurs, and from the curious giraffes to the fascinating insects, London Zoo offers a journey of discovery and wonder. You can get up close with animals from around the world and explore exhibits like Gorilla Kingdom, Penguin Beach, and Tiger Territory. With its stunning gardens and interactive experiences, London Zoo is a must-visit destination for families and animal lovers alike. If you can't get to the zoo, Regent's Park is another amazing place to visit. Located in Westminster, Regent's Park is a serene escape from the hustle and bustle of city life. As one of London's royal parks, it offers diverse activities and sights to behold. Take a stroll through the picturesque pathways, lined with 5,000 varieties of trees, and discover the beauty of Queen Mary's Gardens, where 12,000 roses bloom in the summer. You can also admire the grandeur of the historic terraces, including Sussex Place, Cornwall Terrace, and Kent Terrace. The park is a home for sports enthusiasts, with the largest outdoor sports area in central London. With over 120 species of birds and a breeding population of hedgehogs, Regent's Park is a wildlife lover's paradise. A visit to this peaceful haven leaves your heart captured by natural beauty. And on number three, we have to visit the famous Big Ben. Big Ben is a global icon, recognizable from its silhouette alone. Its chimes are well known and loved by many, having rung out across Westminster since 1859. Six monarchs and 41 prime ministers have come and gone, but Big Ben remains a constant presence. The clock tower is located at the Houses of Parliament's northern end, which stands 320 feet tall. Its clock hands are impressive, with the hour hand measuring 9 feet long and the minute hand measuring 14 feet long. Formerly known as St. Stephen's Tower, it was renamed Elizabeth Tower in 2012 to mark Queen Elizabeth II's Diamond Jubilee. Be prepared for a workout because the tour takes you up 334 narrow winding stairs to explore the clock mechanism, the belfry, and see the famous 15.1-ton hour bell, Big Ben, up close. You can't afford to miss ice skating in London. See, London offers several ice skating locations, transforming beloved landmarks into magical winter wonderlands. From Hyde Park's Winter Wonderland to Hampton Court Palace, Battersea Power Station, a Skylight and Somerset House, these are just a few of the many attractions that host outdoor ice skating rinks during the festive season. Surrounded by the city's beautiful sights and sounds, ice skating in London is an unforgettable experience. Skate during the day or under the stars, then warm up with a cup of hot chocolate or a delicious meal at one of the nearby cafes or restaurants. A fun and festive way to explore London. And on number one, we round off our London visit by exploring the British Museum. What's a London holiday if you haven't visited the British Museum? 
As the world's largest collector of human history and culture, this iconic museum houses a vast collection of over 8 million objects, including a vast array of Egyptian mummies, sarcophagi, and other treasures from ancient Egypt.